Hello everyone and good morning from here at Hobridge School. Welcome to our Monday morning assembly. I hear you all saying, where has the sun gone? Hopefully you are still enjoying life and the slightly colder weather isn't causing too many problems. The sun is due to return as the week goes on, so let's work really hard in all of our lessons and before we know it, it will be Friday and 24 degrees C. My assembly this week focuses on World Ocean Day, which is today, Monday the 8th of June. What is World Ocean Day? Well, it is an awareness day, which we're actually going to turn into an awareness week, which allows us to focus on the benefits that the ocean brings us and our planet. But also, we're going to focus on ways in which we can protect and save our ocean as we move through our lives. I hope you are all wearing blue this morning, like me. If not, please throw some blue clothes on after this assembly in recognition of World Ocean Day. On the World Ocean Day website, you will see the phrase, blue outfits at the ready, blue minds feeling good, blue ocean waiting for you. Go on the website, it is much fun. I will give you the address at the end of the assembly. There are lots of resources and really interesting things to look into. The world's ocean provides so many benefits. I'm going to talk to you about a few now. Many medical treatments have been developed from resources that are found in the sea. These have been used to treat asthma, arthritis, and several types of cancer. The sea is full of tiny microscopic organisms called cytoplankton. They absorb carbon dioxide and help to give out around half the oxygen that we need to breathe. Wave power is creating more renewable energy. It is thought that Scottish waters could generate around 10% of Europe's wave power in the future. people. Try and walk or cycle rather than going in a car. Use less energy. Use low energy light bulbs and try not to overset your thermostat. Respect habitats. Healthy habitats 
and survival go hand in hand. Treat with care. And finally, volunteer. Go to local businesses and pick up rubbish, particularly plastics that are there on the beach or brought to the beach from the sea. Do all we can to safeguard the beaches and the sea around us. There are many resources out there for you to use uh, to help you with your understanding within this area. You could read magazines and articles. You can also watch documentaries. David Attenborough's Blue Planet is a fantastic example of a series of programmes that you could watch. A wonderful series that explores the true beauty of the oceans and all that lives within it. If you're looking for something a little bit more hard hitting, A Plastic Ocean is a documentary that looks at how plastic has damaged our oceans. How this affects not only the lives of the animals and the ocean itself, but how eventually it impacts on us humans. Today is an awareness day that I hope we can make last a week. Please think of inventive ways in which you can celebrate our oceans, create strong messages to save our oceans, and think of ways in which we can help to make people think about how we are damaging our oceans. Please research other areas. The ocean provides so much for the world we live in. If we don't act now, we will cause irreversible damage.